Hey, yo, it's up, gamers. Welcome back to another video. It's me again, Blitzatone, and I'm back in my room, um, at, like, 7 o'clock at night, going to tell you guys, or show you guys something that has happened. And anyways, um, I thought that it would be cool to show you guys my updated soda tab thin collection, because I drink a lot of soda. Fun fact about me, I only actually started drinking soda last... February and so far I have gained quite a collection of things so let's start from the beginning this was the first ever soda thingy that I ever made as you can see it has a lot of mismatched tabs like what in the world are the massive round ones doing next to all of the rectangular ones and um yeah this I, I'm pretty sure that this yarn that I used I got it from school so that's pretty cool um, not sure what I was trying to make. I was just attempting soda tapestry. Tapestry, that's the name for it. Tapestry. Um, and then after that I figured that I need to make a cool one, a cooler one. So I made this one. This time it does not, it, it, it only uses the shiny rectangular tabs. None of the, um, none of the, these ones. It only uses these kinds of tabs. Um. And then I also, like, I tried to make my own little X pattern with it, and that's cool. I did not even follow the tutorial, I just did that, and I'm pretty proud of that. Um, and so, yeah, that was what I made to begin with, and that's what got me hooked on tapestry. And then I started drinking monster, and I got absolutely hooked, and so I made this bracelet. It was pretty cool, to be honest. It used to be, like... Um, when I first made it, like, since I made it with elastic, right, it used to be, like, like, tied it, like, all together. But then after wearing it a bunch, well, I mean, this isn't really a problem now, but, like, my arm used to be bigger and it used to be, like, stretched out. And that's how it got to that length. So, look, you can really see the difference. Um, that's cool. And then, because I was drinking so much Monster, I decided to make another bracelet because I needed another one. This one, I don't know how many tabs there is in it, but it took quite a while. And then after that, I wanted to um, use this pattern, but with the, but with cooler um, ribbon. So I, I made this one. Um, it looks like plain black ribbon with um, random orange splotches on it, but, like, it was actually supposed to- be, it, it was Halloween ones. They're supposed to be pumpkins. But after wearing it a lot, I guess that the orange just kind of started to, like, fade or whatever. I remember I used to get, like, a bunch of orange marks on my wrists because of this bracelet. And then afterwards, I felt like, like, I, I wanted a, a, a bigger monster bracelet, so I made this one with green. Um... I, I remember I saw a picture of um, of a of a monster tapestry and it had like the the double patterns on it but there was no tutorial for it but that's all good because I don't need a tutorial um, so I just made it myself just I, I looked at the picture and I stared at it for like an hour and then I was just like okay I got this and then I made it I also made like a tiny little monster thingy basically this was my first time ever at like attempt at like puncturing the tabs and then there's also original thing on there um also um i have a bunch of other random monster tabs wait where are they all here i have a bunch of other ones hey i also made a necklace as well um this took quite a while with some white ribbon this white ribbon it was actually from um because you see my my um it was some sort of holiday or whatever and i bought my mom a present from farmers it was some perfume and at farmers if you buy perfume from farmers then the nice cashier people they're gonna wrap it up for you and they're gonna use some ribbon this is the ribbon from the present um and that's cool Anyways, last monster thing that I made, I've shown this off a bajillion times, but I mean, come on, can you blame me? My monster belt. <laughs> By far the longest project that I've ever made. Um, started it three months ago, probably, and I just finished it a few days ago. I'm obsessed with it and I love it. Tomorrow I'm going to bring it to school and show my teacher, Mr. Ladder. Um, I hope he likes it. 
but yeah it's pretty long I don't know how many tabs there are I still haven't cut the string off yet the string is supposed to be there I think so that you can actually put it in and it holds and it stays um anyways on to my non monster energy thingies um I have two things you know that bag that I was talking to you guys about making um I'm almost there well I mean I'm I think that I'm like one third of the way done probably because like I've I've got I've I've gotten this far it has so far it has a hundred and five tabs I think because like you see each of these things each of these they have um thirty five soda tabs oh yeah it's supposed to go this way by the way so yeah each of these has thirty five tabs and there's three of them oh yeah guys do you like my pants um they're cool. Um, they were one dollar, I think. Oh no, they were two dollars. Um, but yeah, this, it's, it's, it's in progress, but it's almost done. Probable. Almost done? I don't know. Um, and then of course, I've shown this off a, a few times as well. This thing, not sure what I'm going to make with it. Who knows, it could be a bowl. Originally it was going to be a bag, but like, I mean, do I need another bag? No, I, I only really need one bag. I have a studded bag, it's black and it's shiny, I've had it for a few years, but I wanted to make another bag out of soda tabs, and so this one I don't need any more bags. I'm probably going to turn this into a bowl of some sort. Actually no, why would I need a bowl? I already have a plate. A plate. And also it would be kind of inefficient to make a bowl out of soda tabs because whatever you put in there if it's like if it's like soup or whatever it's just gonna spill out or get stuck in the yarn which is not ideal um i mean i guess you could put fruit in it but i don't need a fruit bowl um i it this i what's a circular thingy not a hat, because actually a hat, nah, so to have hat wouldn't look good. And also that would also be inefficient because it will halt. Um, I'll think of something. But the reason I'm showing you guys this and um, is because I actually got like a bunch more tabs that I need to like, um, what's it called, add on to it. And I'm not sure how I'm like, what do I do with all of the extra tabs? Because you see like these ones, these these are all of the circle ones and the circle ones i like to use on this project that's why i made this project to use up my circle tabs um but what do i make it's i need a circular thingy i need i want to make a cir i'm going to make a circular thingy but what circular thingy am i going to make also i have a bunch of other random tabs these like this these are for the tabs that i don't really have anything for such as red bull actually Wait. Such as um, the candy can tabs, um, plain black tabs, other black tabs, um, rectangular black tabs, red bull tabs, and more red bull tabs. Oh, yeah, I also found some other cool ones, like just lying on the ground. I found this cool, this cool gold one, and I. Yeah, it's it's gold, right? But then it's red on the back. Um. Yeah, that's kind of all. Um. I love soda. I love tabs. I love making things. Tapestry is perfect. You should invest in. Well, you should. You should. You should partake in the uh, in the art of tapestry. Just get a bunch of soda tabs and begin craft. It's actually really simple. I really endorse it. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you get always updates. I'm going to edit this and then I'm going to sleep. Bye-bye.